Hi guys welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's been a while since I did something like this. So here we are ranking the three biggest girl groups of the third gen K-pop. Disclaimer. Everything that I say in this video is my personal opinions. And how I feel about a certain category. These are not facts so try not to get too offended. And leave your ranking in the comments. So that we can have a conversation in the comments. With that being said let's get started. I honestly think that all three of the groups had amazing and unique debuts. But if I have to base this off of what song I'll listen to more I will have to put Ua Ua by twice at first. But if we take the choreography, concept, stage presence etc in consideration then Boom Bayan is definitely more iconic in my opinion. Happiness is also a good debut, but I don't listen to it that much, or when I do I just keep on repeating Wendy's shine on. Me, let it shine. I think Red Velvet being number one should be self-explanatory to everyone, because their discography is easily one of the best, and it has something for everyone. The reason why Blackpink with lesser songs than Twice are at number two is number one, because they fit my taste better and number two because there are literally no skips in Blackpink's discography for me. Blackpink having the most beautiful music videos is not an opinion but a fact. Red Velvet also have some of the best, interesting with a suspenseful plot type of music videos like Peekaboo, Psycho, Russian Roulette come on. On the other hand we have Twice, that have been literally given nothing but green screens, but is it the girl's fault? Absolutely not. JYP Entertainment use the money they make from Twice on Twice Challenge failed, but even after all these years of green screen they still somehow managed to pull it off and save the music videos. Like let's talk about I can't stop me for a second was an absolute mess the music video at the second verse was, but the solo shots of the girls made the music video more enjoyable. Blackpink being at first shouldn't be surprising, since I think Lisa and Jenny are more of rapper rappers and Irene. Chiyang, Yeri, Momo and Dahyan are more like idol rappers, which is not necessarily a bad thing. Maybe if we get to see a little bit more apps from Chiyang, like she did on 16 or the one that she did on JYP Nation stage, then we will be able to finally see her full potential. But as of now I think this is my ranking. On the girl group rappers. Red Velvet's vocals are definitely my favorite thing about them, even their main rapper Irene has such a great singing voice that we were able to listen to more thanks to Monster Era. While many people might say that Twice are better than Blackpink at singing I respectfully disagree. Nayeon, Jian Gaiyan and Jahayu are really really good vocalists, but if we compare the group's potential as a whole, Blackpink takes the cake for me, plus it might just be because they have less members. twice are on another level when it comes to choreographies as compared to the other two girl groups. Their choreographies are always so put together and represent the song pretty well. My favorite choreo from them is Hachika, I can't stop me and feel special, like they really popped off with these. Anyways I put Blackpink at second, because while Red Velvet's choreos might be a bit more interesting than Blackpink's I just prefer Black. Pink's choreos more. Honestly Blackpink's stylist play safe most of the time, but I still like their outfits when they are on stage. While ranking them for outfits and styling I'm also considering their personal styles like the clothes they wear on airport or reality shows or their feed. So in that manner Blackpink comes first for me. Next is Red Velvet, because their stylist like to play with things, although they end up bad a lot of the times. It's still appreciable that efforts are being put. Next we have Twice. Twice stylist give the girls something other than the same school girl type dresses challenge failed. Even if we talk about the recent two comebacks more and more was experimental so it's appreciated by me. But still many outfits were a hit or a miss in I can't stop me. I can't believe that they use the same two set of outfits in different colors for whole promotion. Like. Come on. But I love the girls personal style especially Jahayo's. I stand all three groups, but I'm more of a blink than a one saw of their love. 
I think all three girl groups are great and definitely deserve the title of being the best girl groups of 3rd gen. By giving them 1, 2, 3 rankings I don't mean that the first one is better than the second and third one it's just whose music and personalities I prefer. Anyways that brings us to the end of this video I honestly enjoyed making this and I'm thinking of making a GOT7, BTS and EXO version of this, so we will see in the future. Plus I'm working on other videos as well so please look out for them. Like always thanks for watching, and if you are new thanks for watching, don't forget to subscribe. Bye.